Hi, I'm Matthew Johnson, and I hope you enjoy the mix I did with Cobblestone Jazz for Accelerator in conjunction with Music Festival. Well, thanks for being here, Matthew. Appreciate it very, very much. Happy to join you. And thank you for the mix. It's a great mix. Yeah, thanks. Uh, we've had a really run of a run of really strong mixes lately, and yours is one of the strongest of the bunch, I would say. Uh, I, I doubt that. I doubt that. <laughs> <laughs> I looked at some of the past mixes that you guys did, and I was a little bit intimidated to start with. <laughs> you mean following up after Laurent Garnier and? Uh, <laughs> um, I, you, 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 you acquitted yourself admirably. Thank you very much. It's a very, it's, it, I think it's a beautiful mix. And it's also, one thing I enjoy about it is it's a little bit unpredictable. I mean, you kind of don't know where it's going to go. Do you plan out your mixes at all, or do you kind of just let things go where the music takes you? Um, well, I mean, this one, I, this one was planned, obviously, because I, I did it on Ableton Live, so I, I, right. didn't, uh, I didn't actually mix mix records or right you know um i i haven't dj'd in, in about 10 years or, right, or yeah. well i mean other than like uh last weekend playing hip-hop at, at uh, ryan cross <laughs> and Bia's wedding and i think that before that i was also a wedding dj at, uh, at magda's wedding in mexico so that's about <laughs> as much experience as i have in the last while <laughs> well you have a you have a new career as a wedding dj to look forward to in, in the future <laughs> yeah. if this if this electronic music thing doesn't really work out well we'll see <laughs> Um, but yeah, no, it is a great mix. I mean, how how did you select the songs then? I mean, obviously you needed a bunch of songs on your computer ready to go. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I sat down with my brother, and and he's got a huge music collection. So we sat down and, and kind of made like a a big list of of tracks and possibilities, and then just selected them. I had a lot of things that I wanted to include, like from friends, you know, like uh, Tiki Man, The Mole. Uh, Deadbeat, Kate Simcoe, um, and of course I'll also use the the tracks from from the new EP with Cobblestone Jazz. Right. And then and then I kind of wanted to take it in a in a way where that it sounded it was relevant to Cobblestone Jazz. Right. Um, and so yeah, I just I just went through it, and the, I think like the way that I DJed in the past was kind of always just by feeling. So I, I mean, doing it on Ableton is a bit. I don't know, it's obviously very different, you know, it's everything's all tight and you're not uh, worrying about the record running out or anything like that. <laughs> yeah. Um, but, uh, but yeah, I mean, I think it's also the way I, when I'm playing live and also when Cobblestone Jazz plays live, we really just kind of go in so many different directions and it can happen so fast. And, and I think when we play live, we try and be very dynamic. So. Speaking of playing live, you have a, a, a couple of gigs coming up at the upcoming Mutec Festival. One you in solo mode and one with your cobblestone jazz cohorts, correct? Yeah, yeah. I'm playing on Thursday solo and then and then uh, on Sunday at the closing party with uh, with cobblestone jazz. And I think Paul's going to be playing that night as well, so it should be should be fun. Oh wow, that is going to be a great a, a great closing party. I haven't seen Paul play for ages as well. Yeah, it's been a while for me too. I think he just put out a new album though. Oh, so I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, so am I. Um, it, I mean, you, have you, I mean, you've obviously played Moon Tech before, but it's been a few years, hasn't it? Or? Yeah, I think, uh, yeah, it, yeah, it would have been maybe four, four years ago, maybe. Right. Yeah. yeah. It's been a while. I mean, I've played Moon Tech so many times in kind of so <laughs> many different formats. Um, but, uh, yeah, every so often a will invite me back again. So it's, it's always a pleasure. It's hard to believe that Moon Tech is now 16 years old. I can remember when it started and all the... All my Montreal friends were so excited about it. Oh, we have this new thing, and now it's just like established. Uh, yeah, I mean, Mutech, Mutech, in a way, has established itself worldwide now. In in a way, you know, there's there's the one they do in Barcelona. Right. There's Mutech Mexico. I think there's one in South America, maybe in Argentina now as well. Right. It's yeah, it's um, certainly it's certainly grown. So to be Canadian and 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 have <laughs> have something like that that's so strong. I mean, I think we're all really proud proud to have those guys um, doing it in Montreal. Canadian pride. <laughs> um, uh, you, you have a new EP, correct? Yeah, yeah. Cobblestone Jazz just released an EP called Northern Lights. And uh, it's actually the first thing we've released in quite some time. Um, we were focusing on releasing um, modern deep left quartet records for, for a while there. Um, right. And so, yeah, it's also nice to kind of come back to it is what it is and release it on that. Because when I when I um, 
when I took over it is what it is again I kind of I kind of thought that I wouldn't really release hardly anything on the label um, unless it really had that same kind of context and that same same feeling and and um, when we did this EP um, Tiger Dula the, the um, uh, one of the guys in Cobblestone, he was just like, he's like, we need to put this on. It is what it is. Because usually we were putting things on wagon repair, right. and um, but this one just kind of felt right to do it like that. Um, and what else do you have coming up? I, I've looked at your and Cobblestone Jazz's upcoming schedule, and it looks pretty damn packed in the next upcoming months. Yeah, we've got. We just we just um, we just did. Uh, I mean, MDLQ is is Cobblestone Jazz with the mole right. included and so we we just all were in japan two weeks ago for rainbow disco club uh festival which is this big outdoor thing um right. yeah, yeah. About, uh, two hours east of uh east of tokyo and that was amazing and now and now cobblestone will be in in mutech and then we come back and then i think we're going to be in um at russia in, in russia at a big festival um there we'll be at fabric um I think we might be going to Georgia, and also I think we're playing in Holland as well. So it's gonna be it's gonna be busy. My upcoming schedule right now, I'm looking at it, and I'm just getting tired trying to. <laughs> well, then, <laughs> in, in case myself is gonna be a little bit different. I've already had a long couple of weeks. <laughs> uh, well, hopefully you get some rest at some point, um, and I'll let you rest right now. Thank you very much for taking the time to chat. Really appreciate it, and uh, thank you once again for this. Absolutely stunning mix. Oh, well, thanks very much. I'm, I'm happy that you guys enjoyed it. And, um, and yeah, I'll be seeing you soon, hopefully. And everybody check out uh, Matthew and Cobblestone Jazz at Mutech coming up just in about two weeks from now.